Lecturers at Makere University have laid down their tools as the university's second semester begins. A tour of the university revealed that no lectures were taking place and many lecture rooms were locked. There were some students checking out the semester timetable while others were simply hanging around the university compound. According to Edward Marvo, the vice chairperson of the Makere University Academic Staff Association, the lecturers had resolved to lay down their tools in objection to new amendments to the university's human resource policy, which gives the university council powers to dismiss any staff member who has a case before court. But there was an article in the Human Resource Manual 511, which was amended by council and was gazetted. And if I can quote for you, one of uh, the uh, sticky issues is that if I, Edward Marv, I have a criminal case, perhaps brought up by Nabasa, it would be in court, it could be an allegation, it could be true. At that juncture, it says that the university will have the, it can take up the case and dismiss me. Even if I'm not yet guilty or I'm guilty, they will dismiss me. And they, they also say that even if the court finds me innocent, they don't, it is not, a, it, it, they, they cannot be forced to, what, to reverse their decision. Marv, however, adds that one of their earlier grievances relating to salary enhancement areas had been resolved. We had engagements, various engagements, with the various uh, institutions of government which are concerned. And finally, last week, on Friday, we received a pay structure, a pay structure. I don't want you to quote that we received the cash, we received a pay structure. The Makere University lecturers have also condemned the manner in which the chairperson was suspended. Because the issues which are being considered for his suspension these are Mwasa issues. They are not personal issues. Because what is quoted are issues which concern Mwasa. Some of the issues are raised in the General Assemblies. But the person who can speak after the General Assembly is the chairperson. The lecturers have also criticized the tendency by the university vice chancellor to suspend or fire his critiques. In the public, if you are looking at the issues which are being raised by the associations, you will find them credible that these are these are these are issues which can be addressed by a manager rather than going into hard hard stance that you need to knock whoever tries to push up the head. Meanwhile, the spokesperson for the Forum for Democratic Change, Shira Municipality MP Ibrahim Semujunganda, has said the problems at the Makere University stem from political interference in the university affairs. But admitted. So our proposal as a party is that uh, we need to restructure the education sector starting with the minister. Kataha, the president, since he is a husband, can deploy her somewhere else. Either she can be in charge of veterans. Um, under the Ministry of, of, of Defense. But the education sector is so crucial that you, you, don't, you cannot afford any experiment. And then the president must allow, he can mobilize all his troops from Makere and deploy them somewhere. Tango Doi can be a full time at NRM, so is Maiko uh, Igitaewa, so is Chiwano uh, Kachiriowa. And then you allow academics to run Makere. As the lecturers from Makere University continue to lay down their tools, other lecturers from other public universities will continue with their work normally after they received a salary structure from the public service, highlighting their salary areas, which gives them hope that soon or later they will be receiving their salary areas. Olivia Komgisha, NTV.